YouTubers and live in the same house. Oz now. Nothing went to plan. But you know, I, I wanted to save this one. Why? Because I think like For every successful group like ours, there's probably thousands of unsuccessful ones. Yeah. There's gotta be thousands. Yeah, there's gotta actually, be loads and loads and actually, loads. Actually, I have I've an interesting story about how beep, beep got into the group. This is some lore, boys. So basically the story goes, Beep Beep was in a a group and that group was kind of yeah they were doing what we were doing in the black ops two days modern warfare three i think it was i kind of remember somewhere in that period or whatever i don't quite remember timeline but essentially you know we were doing pretty good brian you know uh enjoying our thing and i i would float around like play with these people or that people or whatever as there would be so many people that would want to play in our group but there was only six slots so if you you know, you play with someone else. That's kind of like how I, I, I guess I knew him. And essentially what happened was, gosh, ah, oh, gosh, man, I just realized man, I have another story after this. What happened was that group had a big argument, a big dispute. And I'm not sure if they kicked him out of that group or they kind of like there was fighting and he didn't want to be in that group or he saw that our group was more successful and wanted to be a part of it. But back then I was just like, this person sounds upset and sad. I'm going to help them, <laughs> right? You know, classic Nogla. I'm a great guy. <laughs> yeah, this dude, this dude seems awesome. And so basically what happened was I goes, okay, hey man, since you don't have friends to play with, come play with my friends. And he was like, that would be lovely. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All part of my plan. Yeah. So he joined a group. I don't know if you remember when he joined the chat immediately. I think it was either you or Wildcat shit on him. I think he was in there before me. I was like last, last. I was oh, like you one might of the have last. You might have been. Evan asked me to join, you know? Yeah. Because he liked me. Yeah, that's true. Evan liked you and brought you in. I do remember that. Yeah. So what happened was like, I brought him into the Skype chat and said, hey, come meet this, uh, meet this guy named uh, Cool Dude. And I'm pretty sure he, he commented in the chat got shit on by wildcat or someone but he got roasted and it wasn't like hey buddy you can't be best friend you know but it's that's a dude's chat and that's how he got into the group and you also want to know why he continued youtube because there was one point in which he quit it was ages ago it was ages ago he basically went off to college i'm really exposing myself today damn he went off to college in england and he was doing youtube before then and he was doing all right he was doing okay it wasn't you know crazy but it was all right like it wasn't bad as well and he went off to college and he was not liking it. i remember getting in a phone call and he was like i don't know what to do man like i don't like my roommates i don't like my cores like should i go back to youtube and he was like super indecisive and then i said to him look bro like what, what's your mom saying you're like oh she wants me to just do the degree and all that. And I'm like, yeah, it makes sense. It makes sense. Like, obviously that's what they're going to want to your parents. Goes, well, how about you get me in a call with her? You talk to his parents. I will convince her to let you leave school and go back home and do YouTube. And then we got into the call a different day. And I explained, hey, look, this is how much money I'm making. This is how many views. I'm getting he isn't at that level yet but he could get there with a couple of months hard work and this is an opportunity he'll always have so you should let him do it and then boom next week he flies back home and does YouTube so I'm like I brought him into group and I brought him back to YouTube we are so so grateful <laughs> Thank you, Nogla. I was doing the right thing, man. He Bless was in a Nogla. <laughs> I was trying to help. Oh, I was just Nogla, trying to help. Bro. You know what, man? If you didn't make it on YouTube, you make a great like scout for like football teams. You got great. <laughs> I see potential. <laughs> I'm great at spotting potential. Oh, uh, dude. It's actually crazy when I think about it. Wasn't there another thing you thought of? Well, the th I, to make me look good, I did talk to him before he ever went public to attack you. I was like, hey, man, bury the hatchet, bro. Like, Ryan will say sorry if you say sorry. Like, it'll be chill. It's not that big. Of, you know, I was just like, you know, bygones be bygones. You know, just move on. It ain't worth it. This will just hurt you more in the long run. And he was like... Nah, <laughs> basically. And I was like, oh man, he ain't listening. Oh, this ain't good. Uh, you know, I, I, I also, I feel like if he listened to me, you wouldn't have done most of the bad shit he did. But yeah, uh, oh man, uh, videos not going great. <laughs> I'm just letting him go. I'm just like, yeah. <laughs> uh.
I really tried, guys. I really tried. The moral of the story is don't try. <laughs> Brian, if there's any advice I could give you, it's listen to my advice, Brian. Or don't. I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm so grateful for you, bro.